What is it going? Hey guys, welcome to another new construction home tour. Today we're going inside the Woodland by Meritage Homes in the Viva on Via Vara community. I love saying that, Viva on Via Vara a community in Broomfield in the greater Denver, Colorado area. If you're new to my channel, what is up? My name is Tori Drake. I'm a local Denver realtor who does a lot of work in the new construction space all over the greater Denver area, north, east, south, west, all of those directions. Now, the most important thing I want you to know, if you're new to these videos, my new home tour videos, I need you to know this. The most important thing to know is it doesn't matter when the video is posted today or five years ago you can use all my new construction home tours to shop for your home regardless of when they're posted because builders are always building new communities taking these model homes and plugging them into those communities so if you'd like a list of communities of where this model home the woodland or other ones like it are being built feel free to reach out i'm happy to get you an updated list i can also let you know if they're still building them and if they're available in this community if you guys dig the video hit like hit subscribe let's jump into the woodland. All right, here we are inside the woodland. I've got the fence right behind me, so that's why I'm so darn close to this home right now. Nice big patio. You get a lot of a, you got a park right across this, right here in the main part of the community. That park is maintained by the city of Broomfield. So it's not something you'd be paying for uh, in your HOA dues, which is a big bonus. Friendly reminder, this community does not have uh, like a rec center or a pool. And that was pretty much, Meritage says, perfect, uh, purposefully by design so they can keep their HOA dues low. Because right now the HOA dues are like 95 a month. And a lot of times it is a rec center or a pool. Over the course of time, repairs need to be done. That can cause a special assessment, uh, which can cause HOA dues to go up or homeowners to have to pay a bunch of money out of pocket. With a community like this one that doesn't have those, extra amenities, you don't run the risk of assessments and you could have a lower HOA payment as well. I'm always a big fan of showing what you see when you're at the sink. Nice big open space. Also for Meritage, the refrigerator and the washer and dryer do not come with the property. So you are responsible for your own washer and dryer and refrigerator. Also worth noting with Meritage, uh, they're doing they're only doing spec homes right now for if the properties are below seven hundred thousand uh, dollars. Basically, meaning that you don't get to choose any of the custom designs or finishes or packages. The properties are pre put together. They pick the countertops. They pick the cabinets. Um, so you don't really get to choose anything, but you still get a brand new home, which is awesome. All right, let's go upstairs. One final look down here. And here we go. At the time of this recording, uh, Meritage is offering $20,000 as an incentive if you work with uh, their lender. Oh, I made a bad mistake talking while going upstairs. I'm out of breath now. But if you work with their lender, you get a $20,000 to put towards closing costs or an interest rate buy down. And closing costs with Meritage uh, for this home. Actually, you know what? I'm actually not going to say that because the closing costs could vary by the time you watch this video. So, but anyway, they're offering $20,000 towards rate buy downs or closing costs, tankless water heater. And like I said, washer and dryer not included. I kicked the thing. Now, if you watch my videos, you know I'm a big fan of the guest bedrooms being on the opposite end of the house as the primary bedrooms. That way, if someone's sleeping in on either the kids or the parents or whoever's using the guest bedrooms, 
Um, they don't have to wake them up by moving around, getting around, because they're on opposite ends of the home, which is always, in my opinion, a plus. Hi, by the way, that's me. I just got this shirt. I'm very excited about the colors. I'm a big shirt guy. <laughs> that was dumb to say, but you know what I mean. All right, guys, grand finale, primary bedroom. Here we go. Actually, before we do that, quick peek. Linen closet, very nice. And here we go. Dual sinks, of course, as you'd hope. Guys, if you dug this video, if you like new construction home tours, if you like information on the greater Denver area, hit that like and hit that subscribe, guys. I know it's such a silly cliche ask, but it's a ton, I'm not gonna lie, it is a ton of work doing this YouTube channel, and it helps so much if you hit that like and subscribe, and I appreciate the heck out of it. So if you are liked and subscribed, thank you very much. If you haven't liked and subscribed yet, uh, consider doing it if you like the content. Guys, thank you so much. Well, that was The Woodland by Mayor to Tomes and Viva on VFR, a community here in Broomfield. If you have questions, please feel free to reach out. I would love for you to leverage the relationships I have built through doing a lot of work in the new construction space. My contact information is below, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hit like, hit subscribe. Consider checking me out on Instagram and TikTok, and I'll see you guys on the next one.